We are excited. It's a really big week, really big week for us. Played very well, I thought, against a, an aggressive Air Force team and came in with just great bounce and great energy to practice yesterday. Everybody knows it's a big week. Everybody knows that a victory tomorrow night against Boise could have us sweeping the road round one, which is just huge, and continues in our opportunity to control our own destiny uh, for a Mountain West Conference championship. A lot of challenges. You know, Boise, along with a couple other teams in our league, has really been hit with some injuries. They've had to bounce back from a couple setbacks with their personnel. But without question, they have the best center in the league. Uh, Lauren Lenhart is first team preseason all-conference and a double-double machine. We will have our hands filled with her. By the same token, they have good speed on the perimeter and go challenge us. So we know it's going to be a game. Well, I think, I think really the, the thing that – probably the best thing is we didn't come back after Christmas very sharp, you know, for whatever reason. And you know, we beat a pretty good SMU team here, lost Oklahoma State. And we, we weren't sharp starting conference, and we give up 80 points in our conference opener at home to Fresno. And I, I really felt at that point we had a tough stretch. We had three games in seven days, two on the road. It was like, we got to start, start guarding or nothing else really matters. And I think more than anything, it's the improvement. Like we've had one game, UNLV scored 60. We've had one game where we haven't met our goal of keeping people under 59. We've continued to improve. And if you can start, you know, this is right when you want to start getting that momentum to start building. So not only, you know, first we've had incredible point guard play. I mean, Chelsea Hopkins is the only – athlete in America who's had three double-doubles. And she kind of carried us through some rough spots, and now everybody's kind of drinking that Kool-Aid. And it's hard to win on the road. And I would tell you that as I watch film, you know, we're the defending champions, and most of our opponents have beaten at least two, maybe three times a year ago. So I'll watch a team on film, and they're a different team when they play the Aztecs. You know, they remember the year prior. So we've taken people's best shots as we've continued along this stretch. So excited excited for for where we are and i think our team as a group getting better getting more used to people being in different places and and being in, again biggest thing to be in position to control your own destiny to not have to hope this guy beats this guy to help you do what you need to do i was late because you didn't write that article yet about that practice jam and i've been over in peterson gym and had to run over here so if we could put some pressure on this guy over here to get that going mm-hmm yeah, because we, 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 have, we have to catch flights, so we're over there. I digress. I, you know, I'm rather colloquial when we have our press settings. I hope no one minds. <laughs> Any other questions? The camera guys are dying to ask questions. They always are. <laughs> Anything? Okay, guys, it's a big week. Let's pack Viejas on Wednesday night. We're going to get a double dip over the Broncos, women and men, and keep this good thing going. Thank you.